I want to talk to you today about two kingdoms, the kingdom of light and the kingdom of darkness. Now behind me, we have a beautiful lighthouse, the St. Simons Island Lighthouse in St. Simons, Georgia in the United States beautiful. We're right here by the ocean, right here by the seaside. Jesus went many times to the seaside, and there he taught his disciples. I love to go by the ocean, and I love to think about uh, what Jesus said in his word, that he was the light of the world. In the New Testament, Jesus said, I am the light of the world. And then he says to his disciples in Matthew, he says, you are the light of the world. And we're to go forth and to shine in this world wherever we go. We're to bring the kingdom of light into people's lives and give them hope and give them an anchor for their soul. I want you to think about the kingdom of light. In the kingdom of light, we have healing. We have salvation. We have hope and peace. We have love. And then in the kingdom of darkness, we have sickness and disease. We have poverty. Uh, we have demonic oppression and, and depression. And so I want you to say to yourself, am I in the kingdom of light or am I in the kingdom of darkness? And what we want is to be in the kingdom of light because in that light we do not stumble. And in that light we can walk and have fellowship uh, with, with our Father, with the Father of light. Hallelujah. In Him is no darkness whatsoever. And so as I think about that today, I want you to consider where you are. And if you're not in the kingdom of light, you can be so today. Just by calling upon the name of Jesus, you can become saved. And you can begin to operate and function in the kingdom of light. In the kingdom of life, there's prosperity. There's, there's health for your soul and for your mind and for your body, for your finances, for your marriages. And so as we consider the kingdom of light today, we think about the good things, the goodness of God and the mercy of God that is in that kingdom. And we can move and we can live and move and have our being in Christ Jesus. You know, and if we go back over to the kingdom of darkness, we know that Satan is the is the the prince of this world, and he likes to come to kill, steal, and destroy. In John 10, 10, it says that. But it also says in that same verse that Jesus comes to give life and to give it more abundantly. You know, I can't think of a, a better place to talk about the light than when, when you're here uh, on the seaside in the in in the in the brightness of his of his glory and when we see the lighthouse behind behind me think about how he guides us and leads us uh, into his truth his holy spirit is that lighthouse for us and you know the lighthouse keeps uh, sailors and this is one of the the functioning lighthouses in this coastal area and it still is maintained and the ships see that light and they can uh, be guided away from the rocks and away from the the harmful and and dangerous uh, situations that they might get into and so as we think about that the light gives us direction it says the light of his of his word uh, shall guide our pathway. Hallelujah. You know, that light that's within you, you can follow and you can uh, rest assured that it's going to lead you into your destiny and into your purpose. The kingdom of light. Come into the kingdom of light. I pray for you today that you will um, flee from those dark elements. Flee from arguing. Flee from unforgiveness. Flee from sickness and disease. Flee those things and come into the light where you can live and, and be peaceful and you can have fellowship with the Lord. 
Right now, I pray for those that have migraine headaches. Be healed in Jesus' name. I pray for those that have rheumatoid arthritis in their body, that that will leave your body now in Jesus' name. Healing is in the kingdom of light. Jesus is the healer. By his stripes, you are healed. Digestive problems are being healed right now. Receive your healing in Jesus' name. Knees are being healed right now. Receive your healing in Jesus' name. I speak to those uh, those uh, nodules, uh, any place on your body, knots, any place in your body. In Jesus' name, there's two women that are watching this video right now that you've been diagnosed with breast cancer and God is drying that up in Jesus name right now receive it receive it from him receive his light in Jesus name thank you so much for viewing this video